Hi everyone, so I'm going to quick show you how to clean your silicone mat, oven mat, whatever you want to call it, um, because it does get dirty. Uh, what it does is when you heat it up in the oven, this is why stuff don't stick, is the molecules in the mat open up and it absorbs the grease and the oils of whatever you're cooking. That gets trapped in there when it cools down. That's why your mats every now and then get stinky. So what we're going to do is, we're going to run hot water, not boiling hot water, but hot water over it. Get it good and wet. Try to open those molecules back up there a little bit. And then I've got some baking soda. We're gonna spread that on there. And some lemon juice. Doesn't matter what brand. And you're just gonna pour that on there like that. And then I have this a scrubby you can get whatever kind you want and just work it in and it already smells better but look at it it picks all that out you want to work it all the way to the ends and just kind of push it in You don't have to do this every time, but when you see it start getting funky, you want to get it cleaned. <laughs> okay, so we got it all there. And so this is well baked in. So I'm going to set my timer for 10 minutes and I will come back and we'll finish this off. Okay, the timer went up. Look at that, ew, right? All right, so I'm gonna run the water. I'm just going to slide that right in here. So now you can see, I'll try not to be too noisy for you. I'll put it on low. Look at how well that cleaned that right off. You can pretty much wipe off any of the sticky stuff. I just kind of go through and I wipe it. I use this as a, my scrubby type thing. And this is really old. This is well over four years old. So it's not going to be perfect, but I got it cleaned enough to where it works good. All right. I rinse it well. Both sides. And let me lift you up. So I rinsed it off really good and I shake it, let it air dry. I'll hang it over the back of my chair for a little bit. And then once it's dry, I take a clean towel. Well, I'll just come back and show you when it's dry what I do. All right, be right back. Okay, so now it's all dried, both sides. And I'm just gonna take a towel and I lay that towel down like that. And I take my mat, I set it on top of there, just like so. Then I roll it up. It don't have to be tight. I like to do it kind of tight. And then what I do is I tuck it in my shelf underneath some uh, pans and it keeps the dust and the dog hair or whatever is floating in the air off that mat. When I'm ready to use it, I just unroll it and I start all over again. All right then, I just wanted to show you how I clean my silicone mats. I hope this kitchen tip helped you guys. You guys have a great day.
big hugs from my pantry to yours. Bye.